Hello again, Wendy. I love your intelligent comments and questions. Thank you so much for taking time out of your schedule to share these questions and comments with us. Thank you. So here you say, I bet you cost a lot if you do all of that. And of course, we're referring to hypnotherapy and how hypnotherapy is body mind medicine without without the dangerous side effects right and it is so much more i consider it to be the king and queen of all therapy it's literally the miracle drug if you ask me because i have seen things i didn't think were possible anyhow sorry um and yes this time with lights on and all of that i just in the evening i like to be in the dark so forgive about the dark in the other video um so wendy says too bad modern medicine doesn't embrace it. Boy, do I have a lot to say about that. And if you're open, I will be happy to share. Because for the last 10 years or so, I've been practicing hypnotherapy. And in regard to modern medicine, it's quite interesting what I have seen and what I have learned. So we'll get into that. I don't have money. I have insurance. And look, if you don't have money, you don't have money. I get it. And I do my best to work with people as far as doing everything I can to help them so that it can fit into their budget. Having said that, um, I bet you cost a lot. What is a lot? I don't know. That's a relative term. And here is a thought experiment I invite all of my clients to do before they decide to invest with me, invest in themselves. We need to consider, if we're open to it, what is this problem actually costing us. For example, let's just take somebody who comes to me, they have fear of public speaking and they want to overcome it. A really interesting question to ask would be, how much is this problem costing you? Fear of public speaking. And very often my professional clients will think about all the promotions, all the commissions, all the raises, all the recognitions that they have missed out on because they were afraid to make sales calls, because they were afraid to post on social media, because they were afraid to speak up in the boardroom, because they were afraid to face the client, because they were afraid to put themselves out there, just to name a few, right? And so often my professionals will answer back, they'll say, you know, it cost me 40000 a year, 60000 120000 a year. One of my clients, because they had anxiety and they, had, they were on all these medications, they've done all this therapy, spent so much time, money, energy, investing in something that didn't work for years. They said that this anxiety was costing them $140,000 a year because they knew they couldn't be as productive as they wanted to be, as focused as they wanted to be. They couldn't connect to their family as they wanted. They weren't as healthy and as confident as they wanted to be. So what is the cost of limitations, right? I think we really need to shine the light on, you know, how is this dis-ease disabling people? What is the real cost, right, of depression? You know, if we think about including medications with side effects, how do we put a dollar amount on that? How do we put a dollar amount on happiness, joy, health, right? I mean, let's start there. And so then what is a lot, right? If we spend a couple of hundred dollars on something that actually works and we do this naturally with your own human natural abilities, that's the point of hypnotherapy. Hypnotherapy is powerful because we tap into your own inner resources to help you access something that insurance will never show you how to do. Let's, okay, let's talk about insurance. Insurance works for the system. If you know anything about insurance, you know. Let's just leave it there. When I work with my clients, I don't work for the insurance. I don't work for the system. I don't work for the doctor. I don't work for the symptoms. I work for and with my client. And the cause and the reason and the purpose is to help them get the results that they want. That's what I stand for. That's what I work for. Period. End of story. And I guarantee, that's right, I guarantee my clients positive results even in just one session. I want them to see that even after just one session, they can have a transformation 
that they didn't think was, was available or possible. But that's not because of me. I mean, sure, I need to be competent and confident, as I said early in the video. Yes, that, I mean, that's implied. If I don't know what I'm doing, what am I doing here? I might as well just go away, right? I know what I'm doing. I know hypnotherapy is very powerful. It works beautifully. It works with every single human being. I don't care what the issue is. I really don't. The issue is literally just a cry for help from the human body, from the subconscious mind, whether the cry for help is cancer, fibromyalgia, insomnia, migraine headaches, anxiety, depression, fear of flying, fear of heights, you name it. Yes, those are all symptoms, but they all indicate that there is a dis-ease going on. And it may seem like, oh, insurance is so reasonable, insurance covers everything. Do they really? What are they covering? What are they really paying for? And I remember when I had anxiety, depression for over 30 years, I did do therapy and they wanted to put me on meds and, and all this stuff. It didn't help me, but it sure kept me strung along. Just come back next week. And I spent years coming back next week and nothing ever changed. Who paid for that? How do I get that time back that I wasted? Maybe it wasn't a waste of my time. I shouldn't say that. Therapy is not a waste of time. You know, whatever therapists can do to help, phenomenal. I love it. But I wanted results. I wanted change. I wanted a transformation. I wanted to have a healthy, powerful, amazing self-esteem. And I did not get those results. Anyhow, I'm going long here. So I hope this helped. And um, again, I really don't know what you mean by it costs a lot. And I don't know what, that's a relative term. But um, I try to be as reasonable as I possibly can. And I try to help as many people as I can. So thanks again, Wendy. Hope this helped. I hope to connect with you.